A reading from the Gospel according to Matthew. When Jesus entered Capernaum, a centurion approached him and appealed to him, saying, Lord, my servant is lying at home, paralyzed, suffering dreadfully. He said to him, I will come and cure him. The centurion said in reply, Lord, I am not worthy to have you enter under my roof. Only say the word, and my servant will be healed. For I too am a man subject to authority, with soldiers subject to me. And I say to one, Go, and he goes, and to another, Come here, and he comes, and to my slave, Do this, and he does it. When Jesus heard this, he was amazed and said to those following him, Amen, I say to you, in no one in Israel have I found such faith. I say to you, many will come from the east and the west and will recline with Abraham, Isaac and Jacob at the banquet in the kingdom of heaven. But the children of the kingdom will be driven out into the outer darkness where there will be wailing and grinding of teeth. And Jesus said to the centurion, You may go. As you have believed, let it be done for you. And at that very hour, his servant was healed. Jesus entered the house of Peter and saw his mother-in-law lying in bed with a fever. He touched her hand, the fever left her, and she rose and waited on him. When it was evening, they brought him many who were possessed by demons, and he drew out the spirits by a word and cured all the sick to fulfill what had been said by Isaiah the prophet. He took away our infirmities and bore our diseases. We travel down this path to meet the Lord. We journey to meet Him, to encounter Him with our hearts and our lives, to meet Him, the Living One, as He is, to meet Him in faith. The Lord marveled at the centurion. He marveled at his faith. The centurion made a journey to meet the Lord, but he made it in faith. He not only encountered the Lord, but he came to know the joy of being encountered by Him. And this is precisely the sort of encounter we desire, the encounter of faith. When we go out to meet the Lord, we, in some sense, are masters of the moment. However, when we allow ourselves to be encountered by Him, He enters into us and renews us from within. We are on our way with faith, with the faith of the centurion to meet the Lord and mainly to let ourselves be met by Him. However, when we allow ourselves to be encountered by Him, He enters into us and renews us from within. We are on our way with faith, with the faith of the centurion to meet the Lord and mainly to let ourselves be met by Him.